Hey everyone, this is Super Sport. Um, I wanted to show the new fender I have and how I'm going to make a slight modification to it. One fear I have is when you're riding, if a stick gets caught up underneath of it, here's a fender. If a stick gets up in here, how do you get it out um, when you're on the trail? The other thing is, the way it's designed, it, it's an awesome design. Thank you, Tillman, for doing this. Um, but there is a concern that as you ride, it could slide down and come loose. Because it locks up in here on the top. It's got these tabs on it. Got these locking tabs on the bottom here. It's a little springy. Give it a squeeze, it's a little springy. I printed mine in um, black ABS, so it's got some tension to it. It's also good for different weather, you know, hot and cold. So what you do is you take these top notches and you kind of get them up here in the top. It goes up there. And then you put these bottom ones in, you give a little snap and it locks in. But the clearance here is less than a finger's thickness. It's probably 3 8 inch or so. And I'm afraid that if a stick got in there, it would be rubbing. It'd be kind of hard to get out. Because I was going to glue this in place and kind of make it semi-permanent. But I think what I want to do is right where these locking tabs are, just put a little tiny filed notch right here on each side so that those don't slide down. But that also gives me the ability to, on the trail, just squeeze this, pop it off, get a stick out, put it right back on. I mean, this is an amazing design. You guys, if you get one yourself, you're going to see it. it's just fantastic. Um, the other thing I might do is I saw where you can do an acid... Uh, an acetone vapor bath to this and it'll make it smooth like the wheel here smooth and shiny of course my wheel is filthy right now sorry about that in the video but it is um, so anyways quick demo this is the fender I had that's why I have two holes here because I use these little uh, push tabs here put one on there press it in Put the other one on there, press in, and the fender was like that, kind of stuck out. It works really well, actually, but I like this design better. So I took that off. I will fill these and paint this later on. Um, I've done another hole that I drilled, and it actually blends quite well, so I'll end up doing these later. So you take this, you get those little tabs under there, give it a little push up like it. You can see it slides up there. Give a little squeeze to these bottom ones, and bam, you're locked in. But like I say, when you're riding, as it vibrates, it could it could potentially slide down like that and become loose. So that's what I want to do is prevent that by putting little notches here where these, these two locking tabs are. And I think that's going to be a permanent solution, and that way I can take it on and off at will. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Bye.